everybody involved. Thank you for making this minor leaguer feel like a major leaguer. I'm Steve Plowkey, and for the final time, so long from the ballpark. Devastating news for Utah communities today as the Salt Lake Bees confirm the death of longtime broadcaster Steve Clowkey. Clowkey just retired last September after announcing Salt Lake Bees games for 29 seasons. We learned today that his death was caused by a tragic accident. Jeremiah Jensen joins us live in studio with how the community is rallying around the Clowkey family. But we begin with news specialist Alex Cabrero, who is live at Sandy Police Headquarters tonight. And Alex, you spoke with them about this accident that happened last night. What's the latest there? Uh, this accident is still being investigated, Debbie. Uh, investigators are saying that they are doing a full crash reconstruction of the accident scene, as well as interviewing witnesses and reviewing all the surveillance footage in the area to get a better idea of exactly what happened. Now, this is video from the scene last night, just after 8.30. Police say Clowkey was walking along 106 South in Sandy on the north side of the road heading east. When he got to 13th East, he started crossing the street when a pickup truck hit him. The driver of that truck, a 64-year-old man, was making a right-hand turn onto 13th East when he hit Clowkey. Police say that driver immediately stopped, got out, and stayed there until police arrived, answering all their questions about what happened. Initial reports from our investigating officers is there was no signs of impairment that may have contributed to this uh, tragic uh, uh, accident occurring. Police say it could take a few days, maybe even a couple of weeks, to finish this investigation. Clowkey is well known in Utah as the longtime voice of the Salt Lake Bees. 29 years calling more than 4,100 games. He had just retired this past season and said he was looking forward to spending more time with his family. Now, Clowkey is certainly someone we have done quite a few stories here on KSL. I remember doing a story with him a few years ago when he got to go to Los Angeles to call some games for the Angels. He said he loved the experience of calling major league baseball games, but he said the Salt Lake Bees and Salt Lake City that that was home for him, and it's where he belonged. Clowkey was 69 years old. Dan and Debbie. All right, Alex, thanks. Now